Make yourselves at home. He's a witcher. Very true. Allow me to introduce my wife, Letitia, and my two little tots. You know who I am, and I've heard of you. You've been asking many questions about me. That always draws my attention. What school do you come out of? That of the cat. So few of us left. Hmm. I could understand a witcher becoming a hired assassin, but a merchant? Why ever not? Not one among us doesn't dream of changing our life. I simply did not stop at dreaming. They say no witcher has ever died in his bed. I aim to be the first. Remains to be seen. Witchers can't have children. But they can have wards, or take in a woman along with her children, embrace them as their own. Yeah, good point. Adoption. My friend needs to talk to you. Let's take the children and Letitia and leave us. Our guests wish to speak to me. Just gonna have a friendly chat. I'm all ears. Talk to him, Geralt. If I do, first word he says to me, I'll lose it and throttle the fucker. Your wife know who you were? We are thoroughly honest with one another. Harbor no secrets. She prays for me each day. You know what? I think it's working. Fucking hell. Relax, Lambert. I confessed all just before we pledged to marry one another. Began a new life that day with a clean slate. Nice place you got. As it turned out, I have a flair for enterprise. Now I have coin enough to provide my family with the finer things in life. With some left over for philanthropy. Miss Marabella's institute does not scorn small donations. Neither does the city's Widows and Orphans Relief Fund, amongst others. Remember Aiden? A witcher. Murdered in Elander. Guessing the killers were paid well. I remember him as I remember all the others, with the deepest regret. Yet Aiden was different in a way. Contrary to rumor, we did not set out to kill him. We were forced to when he attacked us. What's your version of this story? Aiden had accepted a contract to lift the curse from the Duke's daughter. He took the coin, bungled the job, then left once the girl passed on. You lie. We were not to kill him. We were debt collectors. He'd spent the coin already, so we demanded his swords. When he refused, tempers flared. Vienne, positioned as a sniper, lost her nerve. Hit Aiden square in the eye. Later, she devised her own version of the story. To silence her guilt, I expect. I've heard enough. What now? Hmm. Let's see. Don't know if I buy it or not. It's a tough one. Know what, Keridan? Your remorse. It's feigned. Completely dishonest. You put on a good show, but I just don't believe you. Don't even know why we bothered with this chat. We came here to kill you. Hmm. That's a tough one. I don't know if I should kill him or not. Ugh, let's spare him. Leave him. Let's go. You off your fucking nut? Lambert, this is one of those situations when you have to realize you're pissed as hell. Rein it in and trust your cool-headed friend. Let's go. For fuck's sake, Geralt. Don't know that I'll be able to forgive you. I said let's go. You can always come back. I'm not going to cut a man down just because Thank another you. witcher told me to. I didn't see any of this shit go down. So. Lambert seems hot-headed to me. Yourself. Don't intend to. 
just felt Keratin didn't deserve to be murdered in cold blood. Agreed. If you feel otherwise, you can always go back without me. I feel like beating the shit out of you. See you later. Someday. So long, Lambert. Yeah, and you're wanting to beat the shit out of me is exactly why we didn't kill that guy. So, anything else I can say to you? Can we talk? What about? Nice to be together again, wouldn't you say? Mm-hmm. Just missing Siri. Thanks for reminding me. I had to change the subject. Heard a sentimental sob making its way up from your gut. Any idea why she's returned? Shortest version, she's running from the wild hunt. Damn. Going gets tough and you need help, you can count on me. You haven't changed a lick. That disappointment I hear? No. Surprise, maybe. Most grow gentler with age. Seems you're growing pricklier. Mom always said I was different. Had some other adjectives in mind, but different will do. I like that now he's willing to help me, even though there. just a moment yeah, ago he was gonna beat the snot out of me, apparently. So, back to the journal, now that that's uh, tied up. Ooh, here we go, another dandelion quest. I'm down. Where are you, Mr. Dandelion? Okay, you're down here. So let's go here. I'll just fast travel down there. There we go. Hopefully we'll start another quest line here with Dandelion. I want to save. That was another uh, couple of quests in here, actually. Interesting. The last individual who tried to come in on my business, it took them a month to find him. Am I being clear, Chief A? What's the fuss about? Can you not treat me as a bit of healthy competition? Why are you even talking to him, Duke? I've always maintained two smashed knees are worth a thousand words. <laughs> oh, get out! Glad you came. Hmm. <laughs> Getting a nice shot of the ass there. Let's see, um... They're a problem. They're a problem? A problem? There's some kind of problem here, gents. Oh, just wanted you to meet my new pals for the bugger the fuck off. Because we're just parting, right? We'll have our reckoning yet, Chive. Soon. What's this? Some flea ridden mutant got you scared, Duke? Just say the word. I'll take care of him. Take a peek at what he's got inside, then make the midget eat it. Sound good? Next time, Earl. Let's go. Right. Don't show your hides run here ever again. Uh, well, that puts me up to the neck and fucking shit without the shovel. You can always tell who the villains and the assholes are because they're always dressed like, well, masked and such. Shady, those guys. Who were they? Uh, puffed up fish bladders, Duke. What does he's out to be the new horse son junior, but the bugger's missing a hell of a lot. Specifically coin, influence, men, and class. And the other? Errol. A scum jug like few others. Skin of my arse twitches at the sight of him. Back in Mahakam, we'd send so buggers like that down the coal face with a bundle of powder and a leaky lamp. What's this all about? Doing business with them? Exactly, they're plowing opposite. You see, Geralt, old pal. About to ask me for help, aren't you? The thing is... Of course. I sort of kind of owe a wee sum to a mutual acquaintance. Francis Bedlam, the king of beggars. To pay off the debt, I've made up my mind to get serious about Quint. Hmm. Getting better by the minute. Not the playing of it, mind you, but the cards themselves. The rarest of them fetch princely sums these days. Sadly, that's not exactly arcane knowledge. Got a buyer in heat for my collection, missing just three cards. 
But Duke's dregs are all over my arse, so... What do you say, get out? Sure, gotta catch them all. Let's see, um... I'll help you. Fine. We'll try to hunt down those cards. Which ones you need? Fringilla, Vigo, Isengrim, and John Natalis. Devilish hard to get hold of. Duke's been trying too, hasn't had any luck. Wait, you don't even know where to look for these cards? Nah, it's not as bad as that. I'm betting Zed's got them. He quit fencing recently, only deals in cards now. Unfortunately, the arsewipe won't talk to me. Not after I bought a one of a kind Scoyatel carved out from under his nose. Oh, would you mind going to see him? Zed. Oh, sounds familiar. Big fish in the card pond. There's a shop along the south wall. And thank you, Geralt. I wish you think I stand to pay off this debt now. No problem. See you later, Zoltan. Let's get down to business. Hey, it's Doodoo. Hey, hey Doodoo. I can't control what I inherit. Hang on, I want to save. What you do with it. Let's have a chat. That about? She spat in my face. Or might as well have. Call me a whoremonger and a witless hack. Can you imagine? Wit is my forte. Gotta say, Priscilla's really growing on me. Save it. And why don't you save your pouting? Prove to her she's wrong. Exactly what I plan to do. I've always dreamed of having my own cabaret. A bit of paint and plaster, and this place will do splendidly. Just one hitch. I need coin. So, if you happen to get a break between drowners and jigs, maybe you can help an old friend out. Of course, everybody needs my freaking coin, don't they? Where do you get this cabaret idea? It's been a dream for years. Ever since we went to see one in Oxenford. Remember? The dancer hanging from the chandelier? And once she was completely downside up, she called you over and... I remember. How could you forget? And this place will be even better, I promise. That is, of course, if I can scrounge together the funds for some remodeling. Geralt always has this look on his face like, what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> I can't be the only one getting that impression. Let's see. Um... Uh, what can I do? How can I help you? I dated this girl once. Sophronia. That's a name if you can believe it. Has a merchant for a father. Importer of spices from Zeracania. And Daddy Deer would never refuse his daughter Deer a thing. We can borrow the coin from her. Hmm, this sounds like a quest chain of problems. Name rings a bell. Isn't this the woman you abandoned without saying a word? Stepped out for a bottle of wine, never to return? You know, I bought that wine for a reason. Long time ago, that. Been away a while, sure. Which is why I need to draw on your authority. You've got some, you know. No matter what you might think. Fine. Tell me what you want. Got a feeling you've a plan all cooked up. Sophronia could still be holding a grudge after our unfortunate parting. But with a touch of help from you, I know she'll forgive me. And then give me that loan. What's this help entail? First of all, we need to borrow a dull sword from Madame Arena. One of her props. You know, the kind they use during performances? Get that. Then meet me outside Sophronia's house. Let's say I agree and go see Madame Marina. What will you be doing in the meantime? Something I have to finish. But I promise I'll do it before you come back with the sword. Then I'll tell you the rest. Alright, fine. Fine, but... Geralt, the only butts in this plan will be the ones filling my seats. It'll work, you'll see. Get the sword from Madame Arena and meet me outside Sophronia's at sunset. I'm sure it'll work just as well as your last plan did. I had to deal with a long series of quests in order to help you. But that is the life of Witcher. So let's go and borrow this. Decomposing flesh. Human flesh. Wait, really? 
we're at. Oh, what have we found here? Sound shallow but severed his artery. What are you holding? A key. Interesting. Hmm. Found ourselves another quest line. It's interesting how you can pick up some of the quests here without actually talking to anybody. They're just found in the environment. But let's go ahead and do this uh, cabaret quest. Let's see where are we headed off to. That's not far. Go get a job! You damn beggars. Guess I need to cut through here. I'm back! told me much about himself. He was a merchant once? Mm -hmm. Dudu always had a penchant for enterprise. Probably too honest to succeed in Novigrad, though. Precisely. I've told him countless times that no matter how many times he changes his appearance, the good in him will always emerge. Bloodthirsty tyrants and vicious assassins. He played them so poorly. That must be why. Whereas, he always made for an excellent trusted servant, or ghost of the old king. Got a request. Need to borrow one of your props. One of the swords you use for stage battles. My. Whatever do you need that for? I don't know. But Dandelion claims it's essential. Oh, yes. I suspected Master Dandelion might have a hand in this. I certainly hope you don't aim to compete with me. Thanks. I'll try not to damage it. So long. All right. I'm definitely not going to compete with you. I think one stage play is enough for Geralt. That is definitely enough for one day. Holy moly, you're a... That's just talk. So we have to go and meet Dandelion near the house after dusk. Glad I read the objective because I'd probably be running around in circles trying to figure out where the hell he went. Mm. Alright, so he's not here right now. Let's wait until. Okay, it is. dusk. Maybe I need to go a little bit farther. Meditate a little longer. Where are you, Master Dandelion? My husband's a supervisor. Ah. I don't see you, my friend. Alright, let's uh, wait a little bit longer, perhaps. Getting this right, am I? Don't see Master Dandelion. 